Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Cypress, and today we are looking at how to link your YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and also your Reddit to uh, your Discord server in a certain channel to send messages. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in there. So as usual, we're going to go ahead and start off in our Discord webpage, and we're just going to go ahead and go to server settings in whatever server that you want to send it in. And then we can go to integrations and click on webhooks and then create a new webhook. And from here, you could see that there is a name, channel, uh, and then avatar. So you can change the avatar and then change the name. Uh, I'm going to have this send into my Facebook posts uh, thing. So we can just name this Facebook. And then from here, we can go ahead and copy this webhook URL. Uh, and then now we can search up ifttt.com. It'll be that exact link be in the description. Uh, and then most of you will probably have to create an account. Usually you can link this to your Google account. Uh, and then once you do that, we can go to my applets and then create. Uh, so you can see that there's if this, then that. So uh, we're going to say if this, so Facebook or whatever you're using. Um, if Facebook, and then we can say a new photo post by you. Um, and then we can, from here, we could say webhooks. Uh, and it'll just be this right here. And then this is where that link right here comes in. So copy webhook URL, paste that. And then right here, we could see that there is a method that we need to do. So we're just going to say post. And then content is going to be application slash JSON. Uh, body is really just anything that you want it to say. So if we want to say that this was from uh, like a user or something like that, you could say that. Um, you can really just say any of these. Uh, also right here, you could say, see what it'll look like basically. Uh, once you do that, we can create the action and then say continue. From here, you can actually see that if you want to create something else, it, you need the uh, pro version. But we could just continue from there. Uh, and then right here, you could just say, uh, it doesn't really matter right there. And then we could finish. Uh, right here, we could see that it is connected. Uh, you will probably be asked to log into your Facebook as well. Uh, through that process so right when you click that you want to link your Facebook it's gonna ask now we're gonna go ahead and do Instagram so we can search up Instagram right here and then click on right there and right here you can see a bunch of options so I'm just gonna say any new photo by you and then we could say then and then search up a web hooks click that and then click that uh, and then again we can see that there is another web hook so I'm just gonna create one pretty quickly and then copy that webhook URL paste it there um, and then for the method we're gonna say post again and then application JSON for the content type and bodies the same thing so caption URL source URL created at or embed code whichever you want uh, and then create action and we can go ahead and con hit continue and then finish and we can see that it is connected. Here you will also want uh, to sign in. It'll ask you before to sign into your account. And now we're gonna go ahead and link our Reddit. So we could say Reddit, and then here you have actually a pretty good amount of choices. I'm just gonna say any new post in a subreddit. Uh, here I actually do need to connect my account. And then you can see that it'll ask you for what subreddit. So as before in my last video, I'm gonna say thank meme think memes right there and then create the trigger uh, and then we are gonna have to look up webhooks again and then make a web request and here we can create another webhook and then copy and paste it into that and then say post application slash JSON body whatever you want right there uh, create action and continue and finish and then you can see that it is connected and it should start posting in whatever channel you have automatically. Uh, from here, I'm gonna just gonna show how to do the Twitter one as well. So Twitter right here, you can see 12 uh, things right here. And then I'm just gonna say new tweet, uh, include retweets for me at least. 
Uh, and then we could say then that webhooks. You could see a recurring theme. You're gonna just need webhooks for whatever you use, basically. Paste it into that, and then hit hit post, and then application slash JSON create action continue finish. And then we can see it's connected as well. I'm just gonna archive it so that I can create the other one. And then for this one, we're gonna go ahead and say YouTube. And right here, we also have a lot right here. So I'm just gonna say a uh, new video by channel. So I'm gonna connect my channel real quick. And then right here, we can see that you actually need to put the channel ID. Uh, so to do that, we can go to youtube.com go to whatever channel it is I'm just gonna go to mine and then this is your ID right here so that's annoying okay uh, right here is the ID so click on the link and then just get this little these like numbers or whatever afterwards uh, and then paste it right there and create the trigger and then from there same thing as before web hooks click and then go back make another web hook Call it YouTube, save, copy, paste, and then same as before, post, application, create, and continue, finish. And we can see again that it is connected. If you guys have any comments or questions, make sure to leave it in the comments. And if you have any other questions, you can go ahead and uh, DM me in on uh, Discord or just join the server and ask me there. Uh, but if you guys liked the video, make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care and have a wonderful day. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I love this street. Hollywood, baby, home with the freaks. Yeah, yeah girl, you the freak. Of the